Ladies and gentlemen, we are live! <laughs> to the back at some point here. Aljo does a good job of using his length to secure takedowns. He fakes and he shoots that hard double leg to take his opponents down. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. a tall fighter and he's going to have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. Oh, he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Oh! Massive kick to the head. Big knee there. Gotta love how it's playing out between these two offensively-minded fighters here. Well, Sterling comfortable wherever the fight goes, but you're seeing a lot of the improvements he's made in his stand-up under Ray Longo, and at least early on in this one, more than content to strike. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Catches the leg here, and now goes for the takedown It's there. Our position here, DC. You have an extra pop in your step when you talk about fighters working out of this half guard. Oh, man. I like half guard as a top fighter. I understand half guard as a bottom fighter. Don't want to be there. It's right. very dangerous. But if you are there, you have to be winning. The position of the underhook opens up so many opportunities for you to either escape or sweep. Sterling's got the full mountain. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Sterling's back in full mount. Oh. Round two is next. All right, so that's the end of the round. Potential adversity here. He's got a cut on his cheek sustained from that strike in the round. Now the focus becomes maximizing these 60 seconds shutting that cut and preventing it from becoming a major factor here moving forward. All right, let us show you all that was done in terms of the damage in that previous round. He has got a huge gash on his cheek. I mean, there was that shot right there. That one landed and opened him up. What a nasty combination thrown by his opponent. But this cut now is another issue to deal with. He's got one of the best fighters in front of him, and he's dealing with this cut on the cheek. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. All right, I've got a novel idea when you've got a submission base like this guy does. Well, that is exactly how you turn defense into offense. Catches the kick and dumps him on the mat. What a great job. I that kick. Drive him into his opponent and put him on his back. Well, no denying that he lost him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find beautiful timing and placement to land the flying hit. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Well, he 
see this a lot in DC, but this instance is particularly surprising to see a wrestler on his level not attempt to change the level. I don't understand it. You know, when you have that weapon, when you have that ability to take you to the ground, you have to use it. Even if it's to set up your striking, I don't understand why he is not trying to change his level, get to the hips, and get takedown. Under three minutes here to go around two. Sterling gets crushed with that hook. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Leg attempt here. Nice job to catch the leg and work it into a takedown. All right, looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but there's nothing to worry about now, but he's got to start to protect it. There it is. Now he's going to mount. O'Malley's in half court. Nice transition. Under a minute now to go in this one. Oh, he's got a lot of different arm bars he can go to attacking here. What a tight arm bar. Oh, what's he doing now? He goes belly down. He goes belly down to try to get the finish. Oh, he's out. Notice how his opponent circles back up to his right. Back towards the side that his opponent was on. Got his hips all the way across to release the pressure off of his arm. Beautiful submission defense. Starting to swell oh, oh. Round three next. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. So potentially a big factor here, ladies and gentlemen. The cut on the cheek sustained in that round. Certainly better to be below than above the eye, but the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Everything we do has to All right, let us now get you some replays of all the damage done in that previous round, including the strike that opened up the cut. Yeah, some nasty strikes landed over the course of that round, and it opened up a nasty cut. He has got to find a way to change some things defensively or that cut is just going to get worse and worse. And the worse it gets, the more he runs the risk of this fight getting stopped. Ready. Ready. Doing the final round here. Great commitment to the kicking game. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Road takedown. Oh, the air. What a massive takedown. Oh, right into Mount. Look at that. Recognize he's about to lose position. Sterling's right back to the full mount here. Oh, pin the This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He landed a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. That is tight. Oh, he escapes! He got out! He, wow, that is great submission defense. All right, so the big storyline in this one. Oh, my God.